This is it. The big day. Did you get any sleep? No. Yeah, I went to bed at like 1 a.m. or so. Oh, uh, what time did you wake up? 3 a.m. Hey. It's only two hours, Apollo. But at least you have me. I slept for a million years before being awoken. I'm a primordial el elder god that uh, fucking has been around since the dawn of time. The magic is just my dark fucking eldritch powers coming to light. Mr. Hat is my patron. I'm a warlock, Apollo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here he is. So, Mr. Wright, you know who the prosecutor's witness is, right? Alita Tiala, your client's fiance. She's going to be a witness? But that seems odd. Why would she testify her uh, against her own fiance? You have to wonder what Gavin's up to. I. The acquisition of the murder weapon, the preparation for the act. Our poor defendant told all you see. To his betro betrothed. He's betrove? <laughs> his trove of bees. I'd like to admit <clears throat> this to evidence. I'd like to admit in this hive of bees. <laughs> well, I have seen a parrot testify, so this makes sense. I'd like to cross-examine those bees, Your Honor. What do they know? <laughs> you foolish bees. When you said bzz, 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 your left wing fluttered. Bzz, 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 bzz. You're lying. <laughs> I'm totally not evil. I, I didn't do it. Oh, go. All right, Aiden, what Sean. are we thinking? Um, what are we thinking? Fuck this bitch. Uh, that's, I mean, Christ, look at, man. All look right. at that evil face. That is... <laughs> I'm not a murderer. I just like to I poison puppies. <laughs> One day, however. Let this just... Th this fucking bitch. I'm not the murderer. Oh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, fuck. I must have been um quite frightening. Yeah, you know what else is for? <laughs> I don't know. It was pretty funny. Ha ha ha, he was furious. He ripped his report into shreds. Hoo -hoo -hee -hee. No, he didn't. Don't we have that shit? Incidentally, I had to request another copy to file as evidence. That's. that's Isn't this one. it? No, no, you. I, I had to request another copy to file as evidence. Well, fuck you, Clavier. I have it. A, bother a bothersome chore, but one I performed without complaint. Why is Unlike the, the defense who is complaining incessantly. Shut up. Your brother's in jail. <laughs> your, uh, your fucking boss should be in jail. He is. He was your brother. No, your, your current boss. Not my, not... Shut up, hair forehead. <laughs> I always did. I'll teach him. No, said. fuck you won't. All right. Okay. <laughs> You already know what happened. No, I don't fucking know shit. What <laughs> happened? Don't, don't admit Meaning that. Meaning the murder? I just. Don't uh! know how... No, stop scaring me! How? Well, Fuck this wall! I hate this wall. It reminds me of you, hair forehead. But what if a different connection could be proven? A connection between the witness and the victim. We might find that she had a personal motive beyond wanting to help her fiancé. Hmm, that would put things in a slightly different light. Put things in a very different light, Clavier. What possible... No, it hardly even matters, but I guess I'll entertain you. What possible connection are you suggesting here? I have been showing a connection between the witness, and Ms. Talila, and the victim. This much. bullet... That looks like a medical chart. Nice. Found inside the safe at the Maractus Clinic. I'd like to draw the court's attention to the name written on the chart. W what? Miss Talila? Whatever is... Why is this name on your chart? 
<laughs> oh my god, look at her fucking I'm eyebrows. Yeah, dude. I'm not the murderer. <laughs> I quit half a year ago, didn't I? So there's no connection. Let me guess, you're the kind of guy can't rest until he knows every single last detail of his girlfriend's past. Joke's on you. I've never had a girlfriend. <laughs> oh. And you're a fucking incel. Or you're gay, even worse. No. Whoa! Chris Christoph oh, wouldn't no. let me date. He said it would get in front of my lawyer duties. Yeah, sorry. I'm just too busy. Very flattered, though. Show us evidence that proves the witness is still connected to the Maractus Clinic. How, how are shoes! They? The shoes! These sandals were found at the Maractus Clinic in the lobby. They're yours, aren't they? Well, who knows? I'm sure there's lots of people with uh, those sandals. So sorry, Frolein, but your act isn't working. <laughs> Your moment of hesitation just now cost you. What's with you? I thought you were on my side. If, the, if Ace Attorney's taught me anything, lawyers are not on your side. <laughs> they are out for just the truth only. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, if they have to solve the mystery, not to be like, oh, my client really couldn't have done this. Dude, you fucking you get in a really terrible accident and it's like, all right, you're you're issued a lawyer and you're like, oh no 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 no, I don't fucking trust those guys, absolutely not. They they just want the truth. Do you not? Like yeah, it was kind of drunk. Truth? Yeah, I was drunk and yeah, I did it, but I don't want people to know that. I want people to make sure I don't get arrested. <laughs> Only there was a job for that. Oh wait. <laughs> Perhaps you are unaware that toes have toe prints? Me being a big toe aficionado. I'm well aware. After one sniff of these sandals, I can see that I can see the toe print very clearly. And I identify uh, it with yours, Mr. Lila. <laughs> How do you know my foot? Regardless, a simple analysis of, the, of these sandals will reveal all. Your sandals were found in the entrance to the clinic. Which means you went there the day of the murder. Well, there's a little point in denying it. Well, you could fucking try. <laughs> Do you want her to try to deny it? I don't know. It'd be kind of funny. Can you prove that they're my sandals? Uh, yes, <laughs> I can. Your boyfriend said he bought them for you. But can you prove that I was there on the day of the murder and I didn't leave the sandals? Why there were they there? Mm, who's to say? Maybe I, maybe I left them there six months ago. You know what? You're right. I'm I'm kind of glad that fucking uh, 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 Apollo Justice skips this thirty minute being like, okay, there's <laughs> no way you left them there six months ago. I went to warn him. After all, I knew Walkie had the pistol. The doctor always was a timid man, too timid to admit his own mistake. I don't believe you. Have you, you seen this dude? <laughs> mm hmm. I eat nails for breakfast. <laughs> what My diet is that? plaster and walls. <laughs> oh my goodness. I eat lucky like charms. <laughs> yeah, you sure fucking do, kid. I eat his lucky charms and make <laughs> him cry. <laughs> yes, but there's still one more thing, which does not. What's that, Prosecutor Gavin? These sandals left in the lobby, of course. We can assume she wore these sandals to the clinic, yeah? Then why did she not wear them home? If it was me, I would have worn them home. I I would fucking wear these shoes. I'd, oh, I'd... did we connect these shoes to the flip-flops already? Uh, We did, but we have not done it in court. Okay, so that, that's what we're about to do. Okay, yeah. Sick. And man, Aiden, you are on this. Dude, I knew it was her! So why were the sandals left behind? Flick. Also, I was trying to say before, I would fucking kill in these sandals. I would make this shit work. I, Clavier Gavin, am a high heel man. Absolutely. It's say, bullshit. for instance, there happened to be a similar pair of sandals there, which you wore home by mistake. Oh, found it. That's her fucking hidden thing. She pokes at her little scarf. This is easy! Actually, that that's right. I'm impressed, Mr. Gavin. 
If I was Apollo, I'd be screaming over in the defendant's chair, being like, this is... This isn't a case, this is a murder. I'm gonna fucking kill you in court. Sorry, I'm skipping a line. Around what time did you go to the clinic? Half past, go fuck yourself. Uh, around, uh, you know, after 9.30, I think. That's why I knew I had to warn him. Why else would I, uh, would I have gone? It's not like I'm hiding any deep, dark, evil, spooky secrets. You're hiding some deep, dark, evil, spooky secrets, are you? Uh, how do you know? What? Look at me however you want, Mr. Justice. You won't find a thing. Bad taste in fashion. Oh, shit! <laughs> Fuck you! Alright, Mr. Bracelet and Horn Hair. You're one to talk. Damn right, I look good. Yeah, we look great! Our fashion is great, right, Apollo? Yeah. Fuck yeah, yeah. Tusi. Fuck yeah. Alright, whatever. You're free to think whatever you like. You and your little dork sidekick with her animatronic puppet are fucking weird. He's not weird, you tell Mr. Hat! You're a fucking bitch, man. See, he believed me. I don't even believe in magic. <gasps> you, Apollo, you, I'm, oh, Apollo, oh, I'm bringing out the magic gun. I'm bringing out the magic gun, Apollo. Its I, power I, is it sends you to hell. <laughs> Fuck my like ass. Shark? Oh. Fuck you, Sean. Okay, I'm sorry. Right All right, sorry. This chart was found inside the safe in the doctor's office. Yes. Why would this one chart be in the safe, Miss Talila? You know why it was, don't you? <laughs> the nurse who filed this chart was you, which means you knew about Walkie's failed operation. Interesting. You are in the same position as Dr. Maractus. Kind of makes it hard to claim you had no connection, doesn't it? You're bold for a novice, I'll give you that. I'll kill you. <laughs> That's quite bold. Commend your testimony accordingly. Oh. Too bad, little attorney. <laughs> what? Oh. I'm gonna L Death Note your ass so fucking in uh, no Kira. I'm just gonna fucking like turn to Trucy and she has like she has the gun out and she's fucking ready to fire. I'm just gonna write her name in the Death Note. Be like, yeah, we're Hell done. Yeah. Oh, okay. We doing this now? Okay. Uh, where are you looking? You can move that around. Or are you gonna try to focus on her face? It's the neck. She's not doing it there. Are you sure it's that? Sorry. <laughs> <sighs> fucking... The only one responsible for that chart is the preceding doctor, Dr. Maractus. She's hiding something. I can smell it. <sighs> fucking dog boy Bitch. smelling the smelling the lies. Ah, so you're getting in on this too, hair forehead. No, don't fucking. It. <laughs> I'm not with you with this. Uh, more for me. It's time to give my bracelet a rub. How would I go to the clinic for half a year of uh, for an old chart? It has to be this. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You going for that? Okay, all right. Found it. Gotcha. Oh! Why would you go to the clinic for a half a year old chart? You ask. But you know why you would go now, don't you? Mm -hmm. I don't know what you're talking about. It was quite clear, Mr. Leela. You have a nervous habit. The moment you said the word now, you used your right thumb and fiddled with your ring. <laughs> I've been yeah, eating my but... carrots, bitch. I see everything. <laughs> Mr. Leela, there's no use trying to hide it. The chart became a threat now because of this. A bowl. Oh. A health checkup oh. report belonging to the defendant. The Kit Kats were trying to get out of the business. The health checkup was a month, uh, was their first month ever. What did you think when you heard about this? 
Eh? Oh, nothing. Why should I think anything? Oh, I would think that you were positively beside yourself because you were afraid. You knew that Walkie's chest x-ray would reveal a full half a year had passed since the operation. You thought you were home free when the chart came back to haunt you. Ah! Where did those feathers come from? My fucking b wings. Ah, ah. Hey, forehead, what the fuck was that shit? Wait, did we go to the law dimension? What the hell? Is this the shadow realm? Whoa, whoa, whoa. No one said anything about this fucking... I'm not prepared to duel hair forehead. Fucking... <laughs> oh, are you bringing me to a shadow game? And he brings up a fucking duel deck? Because I'm always prepared. Wow, that's one of the weakest What just happened? The game. Did, did the witness just admit to lying? Uh, I sensed it. With my <laughs> rock star powers. My chest hair started of... vibrating as soon as I heard her lie. I just took a lot of LSD and I, I felt her aura. There's a great aura emanating from her forehead. This bitch magic! <laughs> she said she had no connection to the Maractus Clinic, but her connection was deep indeed, a bit too deep. The deep Kataki's. Air justice. Not now. If the Kikat's got a hold of this truck. <laughs> I told him about walking and went home. Wham! Fuck this wall! <laughs> I <laughs> hate. <laughs> well, fucking one of these days, it's just gonna break. <laughs> it appears this cross examination is far from over. But what? Three more hours. She Can hid you the truth. <laughs> Can you prove that she was originally lying in the beginning? Can you prove that she's here in this courtroom in a tangible sense right now? How do we know she's not a spirit medium hair forehead? Put this blindfold on, spin around three times, take it off, and then present to me the correct evidence that I'm thinking of right now. There's no stenographer here, hair forehead. How do you know what she truly said was even real? <laughs> Holy shit. No one is recording that. I mean, yeah. I mean, I am. Yeah, you're recording it, but it is me, not me clear and Sean that in the it... fucking the gal host just out here just being like laughing the entire time. <laughs> this is fucking crazy, dude. This is fucking stupid. <laughs> you're still close. Keep on her, Apollo. I don't think I can. It's kind of illegal. Nothing happened at all. I warned him and left. Okay. Rest that. How can we prove that this bitch is lying? The fucking shoes. The shoes! How did Maractus respond to the warning? Oh, well, he... Shut up, bitch! We got shoes! <laughs> Seriously, throws the fucking shoes at her. More shoes! Eat toe shit! Fuck! Alright. We throw the shoes in Clavier, just fucking grabs them. <laughs> oh, more shoes! Thank you for this addition to my... My collection here for it. Which I, uh, after which I carried you back to your chambers. Sounds like the judge had quite a fright. No, I just really wanted him to pick me up. <laughs> oh, my feetsies were really tired. I'm sorry, do you say feet? Feet? But what about, but what about? Time to figure out what really happened. She broke in. We know. You know, you can't prove that. But we can! You can't. I, I bet you can't. Here's a bada, what a old chart. Okay, this one, this one, this one. Shoes, bitch! Eat shoe! No, 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 not those shoes! Oh, the other shoes! Fuck. I mean, these still work. We already presented those. We have to connect the shoes to the new shoes. We already know! We know that, but they don't know that. We have to show it to them. God fucking... Show them the new shoes. No, 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 no. It's wrong statement. Wrong statement. The sandals? Now, now I'm not... Uh, yeah, the slippers. Bitch! I was wrong, too. Fuck! No! Uh... Okay, 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 okay. 
Oh, um, wait, okay, so are we even certain lamp! this is the thing? Lamp! Lamp! Eat the lamp! Fuck! We, we need to fucking start thinking about this a lot okay. more. Okay, okay, you're right. Shut up, Judge! Shut the fuck up. Oh, oh, oh! The, the, the bullet! <laughs> They're asking like nothing happened, but there's a fucking bullet in the goddamn fucking thing. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Ah! Ah! Ooh, oh! Ah! Yes! Suck my ass! Woo! You say nothing happened in the doctor's office. I disagree. Take a look at this. What's that? It looks like a squash up ball of clay. You won't even look at it. I, I, I don't know what that is. I've never even seen a bullet. I mean, kind of like you, actually. Ow. <laughs> she kind of got, I mean. There's dude, no she, spiky hair back. in this bullet. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Enough of this fucking around, Mr. <laughs> Forehead. <laughs> Enough of this fucking around, unless it's me, of course, you're fucking. But Not be now, Clavier. <laughs> oh, but this was stuck inside the safe. Inside the safe? Clavier thinking about yeah. feet. <laughs> <laughs> There are plenty of women who have made me sweat before, but this is the first time this has happened with a man. <laughs> I guess the police didn't check that far. Objection! But there is a problem. How can you say the bullet was fired on that day? The gun, motherfucker! Weren't you the one who explained the rifling marks to us? <laughs> the pistol was taken from the Kit Kat Mansion that day. If the marks on this bullet match the murder weapon, then that proves the firearm was discharged in the office on the day of the murder. Not bad, hair forehead. Bigger, have this bullet analyzed immediately. I'll admit it, Justice. You got me hard. That you got you you succeed. Well done. Many of women have tried, but only only you have succeeded, Hair Justice. Only you have succeeded. <laughs> Why are the shoes missing from our court record? Ah, oh, sorry, uh, hair forehead. That's. Uh, I have them analyzed in a lab. I, I'm having, yeah, in, in a lab. By lab, I mean my briefcase, and by analyzed, <laughs> I mean smelling it periodically. <laughs> Christ Almighty! Do you think someone was threatening Doctor Maractus in order to open the safe? Only one person was in such a position to do a thing. Our witness, Alida Talila. Order, order, order! Mr. Justice, where are you going with this? Where I was in the beginning. <laughs> this is not new information. I knew it was her. I I came into the court, said, I'm going to accuse Alita, and none of you, you were all just like, alright, whatever. Cool, I, shit. I, I told you. Are you accusing the witness? Alita Silvio knew about Walkie Kikat's botch operation. She then got engaged with him without telling him about it. As long as the bullet remained in his chest, his days were numbered. What if she married him and a bullet was finally able to reach its destination? Wh what? That's what reminds me. Do you think, um, I'm sorry, do you think that, like, if Blocky and Alita are just, like, out one day and she's, like, got, you know, she's, like, attached to his arm and they're, like, walking down the street and then she pulls out of her purse just, like, a big cartoon magnet and <laughs> Side. <laughs> just fucking like <laughs> the Hey Bucky, have you ever seen one of these before? It's a magnet. Wow, that's pretty <laughs> Why didn't Oopsie. she do that? That would have been hilarious. That would have been dude, that would have been the most <laughs> fucking ace attorney murder in the <laughs> God. Oh we my were visiting God. the We were visiting the National uh, Magnet Museum. And then all of a sudden, he just died. He just dropped dead. I, whoo, that's crazy. And I get the inheritance? I'm, I, okay. There was an exit wound. Apparently, he got shot. Crazy. No entrance God, we just wound, made though. a new fucking Ace Attorney case. We just made a new Ace Attorney case. Fuck oh, ah, Objection! How did you get you in keep... here? Broken. You keep talking trash about my Alita. I'll sue you, lawyer man! Me? Yeah, you 
said. You said you'd... You'd... Abuse my Alita! I think you mean accuse. Same difference! Well, you can't have her! She's mine! I'm clearly not swinging that way. It was me! I shot the doctor! Me! He left me to die, so I left him to die too. There in that park. <laughs> uh, Miss T Talila? I I'm sorry. I I'm just... It's been so long since I've laughed so hard. Is something funny? Walkie. Wake up and smell reality. Like the prosecution keeps smelling my feet. Uh, uh, Alita, baby? The prosecution's smelling your feet. Oh, what, what the fuck? Are we just cool with this? He paid it. It's fine. The signature on the chart. The engagement. I mean, come on. It's so obvious. Damn. Damn. She folded real fucking quickly, man. Yeah, holy shit. What was... What's your game plan here? Was that, remember that one girl from the original fucking Phoenix Wright games, and she was oh, like... Oh, Dahlia Hawthorne. Yeah, Dahlia. Dahlia made yeah. that shit, like, work until the Dude. final ends of the trial. Yeah, you're just a fucking dollar store Dahlia Hawthorne, man. Yeah. Anyway, fuck off, dollar store Dahlia. I mean, even for a brainless, spoiled brat like yourself... Alita... Why does it look like he's getting sucked off from underneath of, like, the sand? <laughs> <laughs> so, the family fortune is what you're really after. That's right. I wanted the money. I guess you could say I am a material girl. <laughs> no way! That's whack! I ain't trying to hear that. Wait, my girl's a material girl. Can I ask you a question? Who, me? I believe you said you were going to abuse me. I don't like that face. I don't like that implication. I don't yeah, like this. I don't like... Yeah, ma'am, I'm sorry. We, let, I'm, I'm going to have to deny this. Listen, we're either I'm on. after nobody or everybody, and it's right now, yeah. it's kind of leaning towards the nobody. Yeah. Accuse. Thank you, Apollo. Don't forget. We've proven that you were at the Maractus Clinic on the day of the crime. Fuck you, devil man. Don't call me that, man. That shit hurts. <laughs> and get a haircut. Get a better fucking fiance. I, I, I could get any fiance I fucking want. You couldn't get Miles Edgeworth. He's gay. Exactly. <laughs> Hell yeah, he is. Woo! Couldn't get Phoenix Wright. He's, he's, well, I don't want Phoenix Wright. He's, he's poor. <laughs> he is poor. What am I going to steal? A cardboard badge? And later that night, Dr. Maractus was shot. I heard about the shooting, waited a day, and then I had to go back. No easy feet. Feet? Uh, with the cops all over the place. <laughs> that, that, that was you? So you were the burglar. What Why the were you beatboxing? <laughs> I don't know. Fucking, I'm kind of vibing to it there for him. Tr Trucy and Apollo fucking start beatboxing and then get Clavier like on air guitar. And the judge is fucking nodding his head. <laughs> He's smacking There's the some objection to the funk up in here. Oh, dude, for real. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> And so, wait, wait, is that the autopsy report? Let me, let me press this, just in case. Okay, yeah, it is the okay. autopsy report. The doctor was shot in the right temple, yes? So it seems. Let's review the facts again, shall we? Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Nope! Silly, silly attorney. But what? Do you remember what you had for breakfast that morning? Nothing. <laughs> Do you mind what you I always have a glass of milk for breakfast. Yeah, we are poor. We are poor. We are very poor, man. Hey, Phoenix, get a uh, job. Uh, huh? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> You're my job. We'll see what the defense is to see. 
Where was the killer standing when they shot the victim? What do you think? Oh, okay. As the facts stand now, we can't explain this crime without contradicting ourselves at some point. But I know why. The real killer shot from an entirely different location. What are you talking about? I don't see any other place. Because you're a bitch. That has nothing to do with that. Well, we saved for a reason. Let's go! I believe we all owe a debt of gratitude to Miss Alita Talila. I was right. What do you What do you mean? Thanks to you, we had a chance to review the crime. And this time, we were prepared. We didn't know that Wesley Stickler was telling the truth. We should have listened to him from the beginning. God, this fucking music. Wesley Stickler was standing next to the trash can when he saw two men. I he love, shouted, I love just as he told us in his testimony. Oh? And the victim turned to look in his direction. Bullet. Fuck his charm. It, it, if it's not the bull, then it's not the lamp. But I don't see how the shoes... Uh, oh, shit, it was the shoes. Okay. The Maractus Clinic. And they're covered with paint. The slippers were found in the trash can near the scene of the crime. And... Also, why were you holding these slippers away from me here, Justice? Get, hand them back over. At, le at least one of them. Allow me to uh, examine personally. You said that there, there's stuff on them? Oh. Right next to the noodle stand. Ah. Oh, and Miss Talila, your toe print was found inside the left slipper. Ah. Fucking creep. In other words, this is the proof that you were inside the noodle stand. Yeah! Ah! Ah! Yet there was only one slipper mark found at the scene. Can this be called a footprint in good faith? Objection! Observe the diagram, dumbass. Apollo, I think I might be onto something. Bull. I got this new uh, trick where I put a thing on my hat. I and call it I forged evidence. I <laughs> call it I forged evidence. I think I figured out one of the things. In, uh, in order to make room in the stand, something would have to be removed. Well, Mr. Justice, do you have proof that someone could have hidden inside the stand? I can prove one thing. Someone did scheme to clear the space in that stand. This is a noodle bowl from the uh, from the stand of Eldun's noodle stand. Yes, and what about it? We discovered a large quantity of these bowls yesterday. Oh, right. In the I lobby of the Maractus Clinic. I forgot that we found them in the clinic! A large quantity of noodle bowls in the victim's clinic. Mr. Aldoon is very clear about these bowls. Well, I don't care he did it. Without the stand, I'm finished. All my noodle bowls were in there, too. And yet the bowls were removed. That night, there was space inside the noodle stand. Space created at the Maractus Clinic, no less. Right around the time you were there, Miss Alita Talila. Stop! Ooh. I don't want to listen to any more of these wild fantasies. No, not fantasies. Worse, the, they're worse lines than spoiled bats. But pick a bit, 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 bit. I would like to remind the witness of her current status. The okay. Judge, her forehead is using magic. <laughs> He's using his magic again. I want to try that one? I was calling this from the beginning. There's right, no right, way I'm wrong see. about let's this. See <laughs> there is zero way. Gotcha. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, Jesus. Gotcha, Miss Talila. I heard you just fine the first time. What? I wasn't aware we were playing paintball. He's one cool cucumber, that Alita. I should not have taken that LSD. Holy shit. Law Dimension's fucking scary. You can't hide behind your scarf, Miss Talila. Something happened between you and the victim in the Merck's clinic office. 
and I've got proof that shows exactly what happened. Oh, do you? Do you, Apollo? Just in case. 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 Bullet. Bu bullet. Bullet. I knew you were bluffing. Fuck. 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 Nothing Wham. Happened. Not nothing even happened. Okay, we got it. We got it eventually. Always default to lamp. What's that? You're touching your scarf again. <laughs> I just love Apollo. Fuck, I love this man. I also love... Aiden, you get it, man. You and everybody else are like... This game Apollo is fans. ass, but I love Apollo. Apollo is the main reason I love this game. Well, spit it out. This talking in circles nonsense is killing me. Very well. The answer is very simple. Miss Alita Talila, please remove your scarf. Holy shit, the vault dimension is down. bleeding. <laughs> what the... Objection, what the fuck? It happened again. There's something it's wrong, so... Kavio. Uh, uh, I just... I should not have done that much coke in my trailer before coming to court. Uh, what? I, uh, I mean, uh, this trial is to determine what happened in that park. And we seem to have drifted off target. So we'll find out soon enough, it. if we're drifting. As soon as the witness removes her scarf. I, I won't do it. This is insane. I'm, I'm an unrelated third party. You're hardly unrelated. Please remove your scarf. No. No! I knew it. So I was right, wasn't I? Miss Alila Talita. Your neck. Uh, uh, Why is she keeping pigeons? Uh, the, that gangster knows everything. He's coming for you. It looks like my clinic's seen its last patient. We have to get rid of that chart. Quick, open your safe. Give it to me. So, you can save your own skin? I know what you're up to. You want in on the family! And if they see that shot, you're finished. Leaving me holding the short straw. But if I'm going down, I want some company. You. And what happened next? He jumped at me and knocked me to the floor. Then he took that cord. Maractus was serious. Deadly serious. He really tried to strangle me. I've told you everything. Can I go home now? Hmm. You bear some responsibility for the events that day, true. Yet if you're also a victim, this court would owe you some sympathy. Well, Mr. Justice, I believe the court this clears up the remaining questions from Miss Tenila. I don't know what to think anymore, Apollo. I mean, she's really cute. Down simp, Trucy. Very well. This finishes the cross examination of this. Objection! Was that sick or what? <laughs> Trucy is pretty sick. Right? Right? Not so fast. This party's just getting started. Now we rock! But what? Those spikes on your head are softer than they look. When did I you can touch make my head? Them hard. When did you touch my head? Also, not now. <laughs> Miss Alita Talila, as you can see, we're not even through with you yet. You really want to blame me for this murder, don't you? Yes. You too, Prosecutor Gavin. Me, Froline. I only wish to know the truth. See? This is bullshit. <laughs> what do you mean this is bullshit? Dude, even if you have a prosecutor in court, in the Phoenix Wright world, you are not safe if you committed the crime. <laughs> to be fair, you should go to jail. However, absolutely, you have no <laughs> friends. Oh, man. That's good. I mean, murderers, uh, you know, it's, it's arguable if they deserve the, the friends or not. Be for our line, I only wish to know the truth. You would get disbarred for this shit. 
maybe not disbarred, but certainly like blacklisted. Like we're never hiring Gavin again. Jesus yeah. Christ. Yeah, it's like especially because like we're in a morally gray world where most people did the fucking thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No one would hire him, <laughs> especially if they did it. You need someone who. Oh, fuck, man. I miss the days of of Von Karma and and good you know good era Edgeworth where they just send people to jail regardless of if they were innocent or not. Those were the days. Back when they were evil. Back when they were evil. <laughs> nice work. You mean I'm right? No, I'm right. I mean, you've done a fine job dreaming up a story. Also, fucking. hold on one second. Fuck you, Phoenix. <laughs> dumb fucking kid. Oh, man, I love that guy. Oh, God, we're dumb. Where? Where am I? So dark. Can't see. Cramped. Pain. My throat's burning. But what's your problem? You, Doc! I know what you did! Ah. Waki? You lied to me! So you you know I'm gonna... Uh, you know what I'm gonna do. Oh. You need a moment? I'm gonna give you yeah, a taste you... of your... Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, it's, sorry. No, I, it's okay. It happens sometimes. Oh, truly. I'm gonna give you a taste of your own medicine, man! What? Uh, let me explain. Fine. I'll give you your last request. Listen, you're being tricked, but not how you think. It's not just me. No! He'll ruin everything! I have to stop him. See, this is what you two. Cram. Prosecutor Gavin, how is Miss Alila Talila doing? She's confessed to everything, or everything in the world, every murder that's ever been done. We're processing her arrest now. I did to John F. Kennedy what I did to the Kool-Aid Man. What, what did you do to the Kool-Aid Man? What did you do to the Kool-Aid Man? <laughs> Prosecutor Gavin sure seems calm for someone who just lost. I think he's already, I think he already knew. He figured out that she was a killer a while ago. Some advice, advice. Now is a good time to reveal all you know. Let me smell your feet, feet. Feet, feet, feet. Have you learned over the past few days? Want to smell mine? Ooh, mine. mine. <laughs> I'm to announce the verdict. Woo! I'm scratching my ass. <laughs> no way look. Court is adjourned. Done. Well, let's head back, Apollo. To the right aid anything agency. Hey, since when did I agree to work at your agency? Ah, we make a good team. <laughs> oh, that's right. You have to go someplace first. Huh? Where? Why, to claim our reward for Mr. Eldoon. Ah, uh, salty noodles, right. You gotta stand back already? Oh, and after that, you can come see my show. With a special appearance by the amazing Mr. Hat. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, it's special, all right. We're Please. Two of the anything but him. <laughs> Yay! Yay!